Hello everyone, it's Tony Italians bringing you a new series in our in our catalog here. We're playing as Ark Survival Evolved on the Xbox One. And you all get the benefit of meeting some of the guys that I normally game with as well. And they'll come in and out. I'm not always going to um, to have them on as, as they tend to talk a lot and it's it's not just kind of get annoying in the background, I would think. So this is uh, this is my hut that I'm in. My beautiful back door. Close. Looking out on ooh. Kill this trilobite. No, don't run away. So we need to get this trilobite. For its silica pearls and its kitten, basically its metal plating. No, don't go into the water. So I'm, what I'm doing is beating it with a wooden club. It's a level 54 and I'm a level 17, so that's why I'm taking forever. No, don't go under. No. Oh. No, no, no. Oh, no. Well, that's not good when you're... And I don't have enough to... I don't have enough to uh, repair my club. I'm going to try. There we go. Okay, I can hit it with the hatchet. That's a lot harder with the hatchet. <laughs> yeah, I got him. All right. So now what we can do? Actually, I have to use that to harvest him. No, come on. No, see the... There we go. It looks like we all got them. So there's there's Naga. Uh, what we're what we're playing on is a is a private server that one of our guys set up, and so. We are using that as our base here. We're not on a public server. That would just be ridiculous. So it's going to get very dark soon, as it does in the server, because nighttime's approaching. Alrighty, so we're back, and these guys have to put up with me talking. Now, I know you can't hear them, but oh well. So what we're going to go do is get some wood because I need to upgrade my little thatch hut. Alright, so here we are in the woods, finally. And yes, I still do have a stone hatchet, but hopefully we'll get enough wood, chip away enough rocks in this area too, and we'll be able to get enough metal for my own metal hatchet and metal pick. So a lot of arc is is definitely farming and gathering and why we're playing as a tribe is that it's it's the communal resources and able to pool all of our resources and that just helps in getting the getting the end uh, dinosaurs Dude, this is high-class YouTube stuff here, watching me throw an axe against the tree. Alright, let's get some rock as well. 
Uh, here it is. So you can see a, one of our brontosauruses off in the distance. A lot of ARC is repairing your tools and basically farming, as I already said. There you go. So, different tools on the same object will produce different materials. So. I was using the pick first and I was getting flint and now I'm using the hatchet and I'm getting stone out of this stone. And you still get little bits of flint or you could get metal as well, but the majority depends on what tool you're using. And yes, because it's only stone stuff I have to keep on repairing it. Can I get over No, plenty. Alrighty, so here we are back here uh, after some somewhat successful wood gathering, and I put everything back in my, my box I have outside my shack. So this is, what we're trying to do is change the, the shack from thatch to a wooden shack. And... There we go. So I need lots of wood. 40 wood, 10 thatch, 7 fiber. Now we actually have enough. So one of the drawbacks here to ARC is that the UI needs a lot of work because it's just too many clicks to get stuff in and out of storage containers. Fiber. So now we'll see if we go back in. All right. I can now craft a bow. I can craft a lot of stuff. A big bookshelf, wooden wall, wooden foundation. So what we're actually going to do is we're going to start the foundation in the back of my house because I want a huge deck. <laughs> Yes, that's exactly what I said. Yes. <laughs> I want the, the huge D. <laughs> Seriously? Oh, there you go. That's how much stuff we need. I could only craft one foundation with as much stuff I put in my inventory. Can I place it? Oh, I don't want the freaking engram there. I want the actual thing. Uh, wooden stuff. Out of placement range. Oh, I, I can't be up in the air, apparently. No, don't fall! No! Oh. No. And I placed it over there. Are you kidding me? That's ridiculous. <laughs> I fall off the cliff and I place it on the side of my house. Don't pick me up. Don't drop. Will you? you please put me down? Thank you. Thank you.
<laughs> he did pick me up for the subscribers, yes. It's all for the views, man. Alright, let's see if we can build this again. Alright, so now I can make two. That's always a good thing. I guess I'll make a bow. Now every single time that you make something, you gain experience. And if I was one of my tribe mates was around me at the time, they would gain a portion of the experience as well. It's it's actually a good way to level up. And then if there was a dino, they would level up as well. It's just all everyone's leveling up. Shared experience. There we go. Start of the deck. Do I need wooden pillars, you think? What do you think, Naga? Oh, thank you. Thank you. I've been working on the rock, making lots of flint. Oh, I thank you, Naga, for harvesting that wood. Oop. Yeah, because I was all the wood I was gathering over on the other side of the river. I was giving to to nubs. I mean, I was going to go build some, or chop some down, you know what I mean. I just need to repair my stuff first. Over by my house. Alright, so let me use my trike as a pack horse. Whistle for it to follow. There it goes, come on. Looks like some new growth over here. Yeah, <laughs> seeing that I'm chopping it down in one swing. Yep.
need a metal ingot to repair this? And I have to be the smithy. So this is not a very glamorous existence, but the game is fun because the game lets you basically live the life that you want to live. And you get to ride dinosaurs, which is always fun. Alright, so here's how we level up. This is the level up system. We learn engrams. Really, I'm just sort of... I don't really know what I'm learning. I need to learn a door. And what else should I learn here? Ladder... Wooden catwalk. That's interesting. Oh, wooden window frame. Huh. Alright, let's get back to harvesting wood. And then we'll turn around and hopefully build, finish building the foundation for my own house. So I'm loading, loading my trike up, and we'll get back to chopping down. See, I wish these trees would, I don't think that the tree size really indicates how much wood you're going to get out of it. What the heck is this? So we need lots of wood, so I'm probably going to denude this whole forest over here. You don't know a house for yourself? You're going to live with Johnny? Damn, it's the Canadian Moose Lodge, I told you. Joe, we, Joe, I can make mine to the Sons of Italy lounge. <laughs> You're always saying they're going to release patches for this game. I don't see these patches coming out. <laughs> yeah. I mean, this is probably the smartest thing that they could have done. Imagine how much more coin is rolling into their development studio. Probably spending it on cocaine and hookers, but I want to be able to build it off this cliff. So let's see how I can plan this out here, because I don't think I can. Uh, I have to make three levels to this. What am I missing? Why can't I build anything? Fiber. Stupid. I forgot to get that. Alright, so let's build some of these. I can only build three pillars. That's awesome. It's alright. My family were farmers. I think I can do it. So Nubs, does the 
foundation have to go on the pillar? Oh, and then you just build a, a floor on it. Ceiling. I gotcha. Alright, so let's see where this goes. Well, how do I know if it's level? Yeah, that's what I'm doing. I'm not doing it to that. I'm gonna spitball it to. Good luck. Good luck. Yeah. Uh, I'm wood. I'll get some of that. some of this oh I can just do that brilliant that was so much easier just build the ceiling tiles right off of the foundation. Then if I guess if I want to come down a level, I need a wall to see how far I would come down. Alright. So what use would that be? Because you started your highest point. Uh huh. Oh no, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. No. Alright everyone, well if you like this, we will continue building the hut in our next episode of Ark Survival Evolve. If you like what you see, feel free to give me a thumbs up, leave a comment, leave a comment how I suck at this, no matter, it's all good. And as always, good night and good luck.